YouTube, this is Seal Souls here. Today I'll be showing you guys how to add detail and how to draw a lighthouse. Alright, so I skipped ahead a little because I I couldn't do this with one single hand. So, um, like I said, you'll need um, three number two or three number two pencils for more detail and a staples eraser. You can get all of this at staples and a roller. Alright, so with your number two pencil. You're going to draw what I have down right here. Alright, now second, you're going to draw a straight, or not, it doesn't have to be a straight line. But you kind of have a square, a rectangle, and make sure it goes against this. Okay, now second, make small little windows at the top. can add more detail and this is going to be a fast tutorial so um uh, just I'll try to take my time I guess okay so now what you're going to do is just make a like a crooked line have it go downward like a cliff the cliff effect and it'll make it stop off like right here okay <clears throat> what you're gonna do next is make like a wavy line and that's where the sun's gonna be so you guys can probably draw a bear sun I'm actually doing this one hand so I'm, I'm trying to make just that's my bird effect of a bird um, besides from that, you can add a lot more detail. I'm actually not taking my time right now, because I, I need two hands. So, just shade in the roof. Add in some windows. Okay, now what you're going to do in order to shade is, um, I'm a person that likes dra drawing sideways. So, um, I'm just going to do it. You're going to shade very, very lightly here. And shade as much as you want. I'm just going to shade. And this is just for texture, guys, and um, detail. That's what a lot of people do. It might not look good at first. might look good, it might not. Depending on how good, I kind of like it, but I'm going to show you guys the smudging effect. Now take your finger, smudge it, and like just go over the, the, the grass. And um, keep doing it. Your finger might get a little hot, guys, because it's um, friction. So you're just going to do this working a little I guess you can say darker if you guys do darker too it gives it a heavier texture to it so I'm actually moving my thumb or my finger really fast right now because I'm trying to save time oh yeah and some of it might not like um it's cold. it might not actually like end up so that's the um, outlining of the lighthouse. Um, if you guys don't like it, this is what I refer you guys using. Use the staple and break away the parts that you do not want. Like this is the sky. You just want it to be on the ground. You can do that. But, um, pretty much take away all, you, all the stuff you want. If you don't want to take anything apart, just don't eat, take it apart. Just use a little more shade. I like taking my time, too, so it's important. Okay. Yeah. Your fingers should be, like, black. If you do it heavy. Uh, okay. 
And now, guys, you guys want might want to take your time at this. Mine's going to look horrible at the end because I can do a lot more better than this. So. Oh, shit. <clears throat> okay. Hold on one sec. Sorry about that. So, that's the lighthouse effect. I just think it. But, as you can see, it looks like the shadow. Alright, now, since we're done that, guys, we're going to focus in at the side of it. You're going to, on the side of it, it's going to make it look like that the sky looks up at it. Or the sun, like, is, like, not shining on one part of it. So, you're just going to shade the whole side of it. Smudge it. Okay, so that shows you that. <clears throat> I'm not a big uh, artist when it comes to this stuff, guys. Um, you can leave your opinion. Um, just, there we go. Alright, now what you want to do is get a good point and make like a circle and then make like a C effect. Like it's facing. And then what you're going to do next is going to make that kind of effect. You can smudge it too. I'd rather not smudge, guys, because um, it doesn't look as nice. So, this is just the effect for the lighthouse. And it's on. Sorry about the scratching noise. I guess this pencil was dull, kind of. But, um, yeah. Jesus. Yeah, I see noise. But, yeah, just mess around with it. And, um, pick what you like. And, um, I guarantee, if you guys have a little bit of artistics in you, you, you have no doubt to... I mean, you have no problem making this. This is so easy. I was making this in fifth grade. So, I was making this in like second grade, too. So, I just chose to do this one as a tutorial. So, um, you know what? I am gonna, to give you guys an idea, I'll smudge for you guys. Ow, damn. Yeah, the friction hurts sometimes, guys, so just a warning. This video is going to end up being like 10 minutes long. I mostly take about, I mostly take precisely about 20 minutes of video, or 20 minutes, like, a, like, one, a piece of my art. I mostly take about 20 minutes. Okay, so that's our lighthouse. I think you can see it. It's pretty nice. Um, second thing. Um, mm -hmm. So, guys, that is my idea. And my sculpturing, or in this case, my drawing of a lighthouse. You can add more detail, but that's how I draw my lighthouse, and a lot of people like it. I don't know why, but um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. Um, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks.